We're in Windows 10. I'm going to show you how to change the IP address of your computer. So let's go down to the taskbar and right click on the picture of the little network connection and go to Open Network and Sharing Center. And we're going to click on Change Adapter Settings. And we see our Ethernet address here. Let's go ahead and right click on it and go to Properties. And then we're going to go to where it says TCP IP version 4. So let's double click on that. And here we see our IP address. So our IP address is set statically. Yours might be set to dynamic or automatic. So if it's set statically or you want to set, st uh, set it statically, then make sure it says use the following IP address. Now you want to keep the first three what we call octets the same, 192.168.0. Don't make changes to those. You can just make changes to the last octet, which in this case is 100, so we'll just go ahead and change it to 101. Now we have the subnet mask. You don't want to change that. And we also have the gateway. We don't want to change that either. If you have a DNS server you're aware of, you can use that. Or you can use a public DNS server such as Google's All 8s. When you're all done, just go ahead and click OK and OK. So let me tell you what this is not going to do. This is not going to change the IP address that is out on the Internet. You're still going to have the same IP address out on the Internet. So if you were banned by some game place, that's not going to fix your problem. Easiest way to fix that problem is uh, at the end of the night, just shut down your ISP router or modem, and then in the morning, plug it back in, and then you'll have a new IP address from Comcast or Frontier or wherever it is that you use. So that's how you change your static IP address in Microsoft Windows 10.